Hey Alexa, play some cool music. Here's a station for cool music, cool jazz, from Amazon Music. What's up guys? Uh, today is Tuesday and it was a pretty damn boring day. <laughs> like there was no jumpers, no dumpers. Look at yesterday's video if you don't know what I'm talking about. Uh, we are getting ready to go to AAA because this lady is taking the kid to... She's really excited about it. But she's excited. We're going to go to AAA. Um, and I'm going to get a map, I think. So I'm excited about that. You should be. I'm excited about a map. So we just got out of the car uh, one second after we just recorded that last thing. <laughs> because now we're outside and it's nice out here. And there's fresh air. And that's it. I've sat in my cubicle all day and I need to talk some. Because <laughs> I didn't say any words all day, almost. Pretty much. Maybe a few words. Because I went out to coffee twice in the morning for both times. So I talked a little bit today. Okay, I just want to talk. It just got really busy, so you have like six people in any okay? Okay. I'm checking out my hair because it feels funny, and Shiloh says it's not funny. It's not. It's fine. <laughs> Look at my face, this can't be fine. Two hours later. Two hours later. Dude, we're at Rite Aid. Oh, maybe I should get a red. No, it's 319. We'll be up forever. I know. Give me a stupid water, and they have beer here. Is beer good? Uh, I drink beer sometimes when I work out. I'll do like a P90X kind of thing, and I'll drink a beer with it. I feel like it's probably not healthy. I guess that's like yoga and wine. Yeah, but for men. I'm just gonna point it at us until something funny happens. Tell me your best joke. If you had a time machine, where in time would you go? Why'd you look at my? Yes, I'm asking you. I'm not <laughs> talking to myself. Who else would I be Wait, asking? A time machine. Yes, a time machine. Um, I would go back to um, the '60s. Hmm. That's cool. <laughs> I would go forward in time because back in time sucks. But you don't know what's in the future. Yeah. It might be scary. Well. At least in the past, you already know. <laughs> You go to the future and be like, oh, this sucks, and you just jump back real quick. What if your time machine gets broken? That's what always happens in movies. Well, this and is real. they're stuck. This is real life. This isn't the movies. <laughs> this is a I real life so. theoretical time. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know where I would go, man. The further back in time you go, the worse medical technology there is. And I'd be stuck somewhere with like heartburn and no tums, and I'd be like, oh, damn it. Oh, they still have uh, apple cider vinegar. <laughs> I feel like that never helps, man. Or baking I, I'm soda. Not, I'm not convinced. Uh, but I wouldn't have known that. Well, you know now. You don't lose your memory. <laughs> All right. It is jujitsu day. And uh, I'm going to make a little smoothie. I have two beets and some mixed fruit and some beet juice that I poured in there. I'm just going to dump, dump that in there. Try to dump it in there. I was going to make it in the big blender at first. But I decided to just put it in here. Um... That should be good. I'm gonna fill this up with water, and I'm gonna blend it. Don't get beet juice on anything, because it will stain everything forever and ever. And we're done. I gotta help the kid with some math. She's super thrilled about it, and she sits like a gargoyle on that chair. Smile. <laughs> Fun fact, I might be the greatest math teacher alive. <laughs> Today I'm the greatest math teacher alive. We're crushing it. We're crushing it, right? Yeah. I I'm doing pretty good. Are we in tears this time? No. No. That's what I'm saying. Greatest math teacher alive. Greatest math teacher alive. Maybe the greatest dad alive. Probably the greatest dad and math teacher. You know, 
I would maybe lump science in that too. Greatest science teacher? No. But probably like the historian, right? I'm a good historian. Definitely not. What? English teacher? Terrible. I hate English. <laughs> I like English, but I'm no good at it. I'm better at English. Hello? Did somebody say English? This guy continues to crush it at the math. And with knowing where our rulers are. And for some reason, we have a drawer of like five of these things in there. Why do we have so many rulers? Dude, Shh. smoothie made, homework help done, time to get ready to roll. I was getting nervous before jujitsu because I don't go that often. And it's exhausting and it's, um, it's not scary, but it is a little bit, man. It just, it's like, uh, you're not gonna get put in weird positions and I don't know, man. It's just, it really tests you as a person. And sometimes it's like, oh, I don't know if I wanna do it today. But every time I do it, I'm super glad because it is possibly one of the greatest things I've ever done. An absolute must of jujitsu is cutting your fingernails and your toenails. So I do that before every class, but that's just because I don't go that often. So I have to do it every time I go. All right, getting ready to go into jujitsu. Uh, this is how I look now. <laughs> Happy, cheery, energy. Uh, we, we will see how I look when I return. Wish me luck. Whew. Uh, just got done with jujitsu, and I don't know if you can tell, this is freaking red. I checked my Fitbit. <laughs> uh, it said I burned 7 million calories, so that's always good. So I can eat anything I want right now when I get home. It's gonna be hurting a little bit tomorrow, I'm pretty sure. I'm exhausted and I'm beat and I loved it and if you haven't tried jiu-jitsu you should try it because it's a it's definitely an experience. <laughs>